see the humanity. I choose to see the helpers. This world can be cold and bitter. It feels like November 1st, 2003, my five-year-old son and his two-year-old brother get into a fight over one toy, and I'm looking at Evan, I'm a five-year-old, I'm like, you have hundreds of toys, there are kids a couple blocks away in Harlem who have nothing. In the middle of this conversation, CNN comes on, and it was a story about the San Diego wildfires, and a story about a little girl who's sleeping beauty Halloween costume burned in the house uh, that she just lost. And I looked at Evan, I said, yesterday was Halloween, you wore, you wore three costumes, this little girl lost everything. And I looked at him, I said, well, what would you do to help that girl? Created New York's Thank You Foundation in July 2004 with the idea that every year on September 11th we would take volunteers from New York, send them somewhere in the country where they had a disaster, and build something. You only need a spark to start a whole blaze. It only takes a little faith. Let it start right here in this city. So these old walls will never be the same. Over. and to institutionalize it. We have the stars from here, kind of Parkland, and to other places. And that's the simple idea is about how you take compassion and empower it through creativity, not through connectivity. That's all this is. This year we're going to have our 700,000 volunteers. All 50 states, 26 countries, almost 100 million people have been impacted by stars and small candle to illuminate the world. You guys are the spark light. Fire in my soul, fan the flame and make it grow so there